Government forecasters have just issued a La Nina watch for later this year. Como forecaster Theron Zahn shows us what kind of impact that could have on our weather this summer and how quickly the El Nino pattern we are all under could lose its influence. The El Nino pattern that has given us a milder and drier than typical winter could be on the way out, according to government forecasters. The NOAA Climate Prediction Center has issued a La Nina watch for the summer. They say a watch is issued when conditions are favorable for the development of El Nino or La Nina conditions in the next six months. An El Nino pattern is when average sea temperatures in the equatorial Pacific Ocean are warmer than average. La Nina means water temperatures in the same area are cooler than average. Those water temps have an impact on weather all around the world, including here in the Northwest. While El Nino is likely to blame for our reduced rainfall and lack of snow in the mountains, along with mild winter temps this year, don't expect a La Nina pattern to have a big impact on your summer months. El Nino and La Nina patterns bring changes to our weather during the winter, according to NOAA, not during the summer. The latest update from NOAA says there's a 79% chance of a transition from El Nino to neutral sea temps between April and June of this year. We're also told there's a 55% chance of a La Nina pattern developing between June and August. But when you hear that you're likely in for a La Nina pattern this summer, don't change your plans. But next winter could be a different story. Theron's on Como News.